Oh my god, yeah you do. Bass, largemouth. Nope, that's a good one. I told you, it's a nice fish. Dude, that one didn't even feel like it hit it. I told you. I don't want to grab your line, but I will freaking eagle claw this guy here in a second. Hey, there you go, buddy. Fish, buddy. That is a river fish. You just caught a 504. Oh, yeah. Well, guys, we are back out here on the river, and we're going to see what she will produce for us today. First day of the cold front, probably not the best idea to come out here and fish, but this is the only day I have free, so of course we're going to come out here and give it our best shot. I'm really not looking forward to is how bad this cold front dropped the water temperature. These fish were getting ready to spawn, water was getting nice and warm, they're pushing up, they're, and a cold front comes through and smacks them right in the face and says, nah, -uh, not yet, buddy. Hoping this did not push these fish in shock where they're gonna be like, not knowing what to do. They're still gonna be up shallow, not eat as well, but uh, hopefully we're not gonna make like five to 10 casts at the same spot just to get a bite. Hopefully we can still drop it on their head up in this tight timber and uh, produce a fish. They are river fish, so they tend to be a little bit more adaptive. I just got a bit reeling it. All right, but these river fish tend to be more adaptive. They're used to these temp changes. They're used to the drop. They're used to the fluctuation of a river. So I think we're gonna have a good day. Water temp's 54. Five, so I bet it dropped two or three degrees with the storm. But 55 is still good. Fish? That's a fish. Oh my god. Alright, time to see if it's a male or a female though. That's going to tell me a lot right now. Oh, that's a male. a good one big spot big spot big spot who look at that big old spot of bass right there all right there's a big spot. How fat it is. Yeah, that's what I thought. 337. All right. I should put on that shaky head. It's such a good spot. Oh, it's got bit. All right. An absolute giant largemouth. There we go. It's 
not a bad one right there. Upper stay. There might be a little too much current over here for these fish to want to be up over here. I don't know though. All right. That's not a terrible one. It's not a terrible one. Spotted though. Cannot find the largemouth. Let's see, what are you doing? It's a little spawned out. You might be on a bed, buddy. It's not a terrible one. Give him a kiss, not a bite. They're just absolutely just eating it so weird today. Like I was bouncing it through the timber and all of a sudden he's just there. No bite, nothing, just feels weird. I don't know. I really don't know. When I first swung, I thought it was going to be a big one. I did. It just felt solid. I ain't gonna waste my time. One more spot, then we're gonna get out of here. And I'm thinking if I do get one out of this next spot, it should be a big one. I think it'll be our biggest of the day. But I can't make any promises. I might not even get bit in there. I don't know. But we're gonna try our luck out and hopefully it pans out. It'd be nice to get a nice sized largemouth and not a six inch largemouth. Oh my god, I start to... So that first fish up there was a spotted bass. I saw that. That one that came out of the water right there was a largemouth. So I think that what it was, there's a there's a school of some, some little guys out, up in here. So I think it's what it was. And school got riled up when I caught that one. So when this hit the water over here, he tried to eat it because the school came to the boat. That's going to be my guess. That's going to be my guess. I definitely brought the wrong shoes to be fishing in the rain. Oh, there's a bite. Oh, he dropped it. He came back. Another spot. Shocker. Not a bad one. Right where I thought he should be. The best structure on the bank is right on it. Bite was almost immediately too. So I don't know if there's a school of them or he was just active enough where he came immediately right after I pulled it out of the strike zone. I don't know. Right where it should have been though. Right there on the point where that lay down is too. Could have been the same fish. Probably should have checked him to see if he was on the bed or whatever it is. If he was pissing, showing any signs of wanting to spawn. Oh, 